I've either just made the best or the worst financial decision of my life. Like, I, I, I get that it, it's, it's only, like, £79, but it might not work. And, I mean, I've also had to go and buy one of these. Like, I, I don't just have a MIDI cable lying around. But I do now, because it's not arrived yet. <laughs> it's been about three days, and, uh, got the thing. So this is the Rock Band 3 Wii Controller Guitar, made for Rock Band 3. So, this thing is packaged into about four, five different pieces. You got the body, the neck, the head, three pieces, okay. Um, wow, this looks brand new, like I can tell... I was going to say, I can tell people have used this. You know, there's some marks along here. But I then pulled it slightly. Has it been used? I mean, everything's still packaged up. There are still three batteries in the side that are sealed up, still packaged as if it was new. It looks as if the box was opened, but I don't think it was ever used. I think that's kind of the situation we have. It's so smooth. I can tell that it's plastic. So this is the body. It is absolutely covered in dust. Um, there it is, got a nice little red and white Mustang. Here's, here's the back, uh, if any of you care of that. And the front. So if you've never seen this before, this was made obviously for the Rock Band 3 game. Um, and this neck works with, as, as a pressure sensitivity basically. You push these notes uh, and it'll play, play, play the note. It was basically just Guitar Hero, but more precise. Oh, and a little Rock Band branded guitar strap, which I think I will use. Uh, as you can probably tell, neck clips onto the neck, just pushing it through. There we go, locked into place. And I'd assume the head is the same. This is a small body. This is quite small. Oh wow, I was wrong. This is actually regular size, it's just really lightweight. In terms of size, they're roughly, this is slightly smaller. That's really weird. It does require batteries. It runs off of three double A's. Uh, flip it on, that would help. Okay, okay, this is really cool. This is linking through MIDI onto my Focusrite 18920 into a full studio, which then means that upon us playing notes, we get sound. So if we play, Oh wow, this is really weird. It's also touch sensitive, but I didn't know that. So the plus button is what enables that mod. Okay, I wanna know if a capo works. Like, if I get my guitar cap on, and I say, I don't know, we put on third fret. Because of it being MIDI, I can play a synth. Um, that's an issue. So A and 2 switch the instrument that I'm playing. So if I play something here, I want to start just that. So another way of doing that is I could just make an envelope that goes down like this.
if I open up another project, like if I open a project that I've worked on, can I just play the guitar chords and get another instrument layer with having only my knowledge of guitar? Caps on that. It's not perfect, but I definitely didn't play it on piano. <laughs> for what it is, and for how old it is, and what it's meant for, I'm definitely using this a lot more. It was never made for music. It was always made as a MIDI device for a game. If you find one of these at like a, a second-hand store, or a car boot sale, or for sale on something like eBay or Facebook, and you, you play guitar and do music, get this. I would highly recommend it. I think this is going to be a huge game changer in the way I make stuff and the way I do synths and piano and basically any other instrument that I don't have in this room. That is it for this one. Um, but thank you for watching and uh, goodbye.